welcome to New Key View Resort here in Cornwall. This is the way you, came, you come in. It's about half a mile to Porth Beach, which is on the outskirts of New Key. The beach down there is absolutely beautiful. This is the way you, you come in. Got the leisure centre, the venue, reception and the sales office. Across this side here is the venue where there is the bar, amusements and entertainment in the, in the evening time and also there is an outdoor heated swimming pool which we're going to go over there now to show you. It's closed at the moment and I'm not quite sure when this is open but it's too cold at the moment because it's Easter. Okay, that's the outside pool. Now in the bar here, you can take dogs in, so which is great for anybody who's got any animals, any dogs. So there you go. Amusements. The bar. And as you can see, somebody's got a dog in here already. But you cannot take a dog past this post. So that's where they have entertainment on in the evenings. There's bingo every night and great prizes. Um, the last few nights, roughly £12 for one line. £50 for two lines and £100 for a full house but with more people there's more money so now I'm going to take you over into the resort itself you can also come in that way if you go up there and it takes you to the back of the um, holiday resort but if you got there and turn right it takes you up through, well, through I should say some very very narrow well a narrow road but this is the reception area so when you first arrive here I would you would go and park up over there and then come and check in here in the reception area. Hello! You can also buy your own caravan here, which are quite expensive. <laughs> now over there is a children's play area and inside that building over there is the swimming pool. Little stream. Up there, there is a footpath which you can go on. Um, you have to go out the resort to get onto it and it takes you to one of the local villages now in the swimming pool area um, they have a sauna and a steam room so I'm not sure whether you'll be able to see inside because it looks a bit steamed up but I'll give it a go. I don't know whether you saw that then. It's quite a big pool, very warm. Try again in here.
it's closed now. Um, the opening time, so I believe, at nine o'clock in the morning, and I think it closes about four o'clock, half past four, something like that. Okay, here we go. Just walking through all the the um, static caravans now. And take you up this way. And we have the shop, Londis. Laundrette. Haven't used them myself, so I don't know how you use them, whether you put money in or tokens, absolutely no idea. And toilets and showers. And here is the Blue Surf School. As you see, it's, as I said earlier, it's Easter. Times of the tides, surf report, and the weather. And there's the prices up there. Look, surf lessons, £30 per person. And then you can hire different things, surfboards, wetsuits, etc. You get a free shuttle to the to and from the beach. There we go. More caravans. And that's my caravan there, number 26. And that's our hire car. We had to hire a car because yesterday my car caught fire as we was driving down to St Ives and basically we've had to scrap it. So we've had to get a hire car to go all the way back home to Peterborough. So pretty traumatic. Luckily we escaped. We had my daughter who was 13 and our dog as well in the car and luckily we managed to get all our stuff out the car so as I said we've had to hire a car from Eurocar here in Newquay which wasn't too bad it was £133 um, from this morning until Sunday so we've managed to get out today and to get home of course They're a bit more luxurious caravans up there. And this takes you towards the end of the park. And then you can bring your own tents and caravans as well. Electric camping. And there you go. Oh, you can also hire those out as well. More facilities there, showers and toilets. And then you've got those there, look, they look nice. And you've got lovely views of some hills, the sheep. And yes, it's lovely here. It's not too far from anywhere 